your luck? Boss? No, nothing. looking? Yeah, just looking. Rich, if you ever need to talk, I'm here for you. <laughs> talk about what? Oprah? <laughs> what? You want to talk about Oprah? We can talk about Oprah. You know, Reg. You ain't nothing to talk about. Don't go give me attitude, Reginald. Reginald? Yeah. What's that? You're, you're my mama now? <laughs> you're you're gonna, mama? You're scold me? <laughs> huh? You don't look anything like my mother. Mm, I'm sure of that. You need to go. Go. Yeah, Mariah, go. Okay. Going on, mm -hmm. Ooh -wee. Is that huh. yours? Because I'd like a little of that. Hey, if she's yours, I got you, bro. I'll even help you out. Break you off with a little something, make her lay down for a man, if you know what I mean. <laughs> hey, if not, that's sweet is all I'm saying, bro. Cause you know I got a sweet tooth, ain't that right, Brick? <laughs> hey, what you doing? Yeah, bye. Reggie. Bye, all that Reggie, what you been up to, man? Where you been at? School. School. <laughs> what, you play ball now? Yeah, I ain't think you was a baller. So why you do it, dog? Why you buying into all this school shit? How old are you now? 16. 16. Where you ride at? Don't have one. That's right, cause you in school all the damn time. You see that? You ain't gonna get that playing their game, dog. Nah, what you gonna get is a bunch of nickels and dimes and cheap ass talk about success. But nickels and dimes ain't gonna get you to ride. It ain't gonna get you to girl. And it damn sure ain't gonna get you this. You see this right here, baby? This is what it's all about, dog. This is where you live, dog. But you're smart, Reggie. You get started, and you will be flush overnight. I guarantee it. I'm good, all right? Reggie, 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 Reggie. What's up? Why are you being so cold? Ah, uh, I know what this is about. Your brother. Look, man, I love Chillville too, but he wasn't as smart as you, and that's why that happened. He made the big mistake, right? He stopped selling, and he started using. But you're smarter than that, kid. You're smart enough to make this money and stay clean. Money to buy you a little bit of sweets, some pretty clothes, money to put your mom's in the new. I'm good, all right? Hey, what are you doing? Hey, bye. I really don't think you're hearing me. This is it right here, bro. This is what it's all about. Matter of fact, watch this. Yo, you want to make a dollar? Yeah. Come over here and make you some money, dog. Then I got. Come on, man. Move. Come on, dog. Watch this, bro. Hop on one leg. <laughs> Rinka. <Yeah>. Rinka. <laughs> <laughs> you see what I'm talking about? Yeah, there you go. You earned it. Okay. Yes, Lord. Better calm that down. Calm down. Ooh. 20. Come make this money, dog. Come over here and kiss my ass. Ooh. Come on, man. When you got money, people do for you. When you don't, you do for them. So who you want to be, Reggie? Huh? Who you want to be? Look, man, I told my mom. Your mom? <laughs> Yo, you heard this guy? Oh, your mom. <laughs> <laughs> Will always told me that you was a mama's yep. boy. And that's probably the only smart thing that that dead fool ever said. Because your mom ain't nothing but a... <laughs> <laughs> you're 
Good job. <laughs> you don't right. talk about a boy's <laughs> guy, man. Gun, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> so I put him off and I told him that I would let him know because I want you to come too. It's a cop thing at all. Me? Oh no, <laughs> I don't think so, babe. It's not a double date or anything. No. I want to hang around Reg. Reg is a big boy. Are you sure he wants to spend his Friday night with Mama? <laughs> uh, I know, I know, babe, but what is it with you and this whole cop thing now? Well, I have dated everyone at Children and Youth and it is time to give True. my enforcement a try. <laughs> <laughs> Starting with... Bye. <laughs> Seriously, Josh, you should come out. I mean, who is going to tell me to keep my panties on if you are not there? <laughs> you mean help you find them my clothes? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. You need to get out. I told Reg we'd go out to a movie. He's not going to be watching movies with Mama forever. And besides, I told you, I see him with the, uh, I, the king girl Mariah, the girl with the woman's body. <gasps> Ooh. I am sure Reg doesn't notice. He's a teenage boy, honey. He sees it. And he wants it. Hell, I want it. If I had a tight little booty like that, I wouldn't need to just throw myself at the vice. They, they would come looking for me. <laughs> Babe, it's like I told you, Reg is still adrift. Ever since his brother died, he's just going through the motions. I know, honey. Just try to take a step back for a minute and take yourself out of the picture. I mean... We've seen this a million times at Children and Youth, right? Yes. And what do we tell the clients? Vivian. Well, what do we tell the clients? You have to think of yourself, too. You have to show them that life goes on. I know, Vin. It's just different when it's your home, that's all. Wait, stop. Go away. No, stop. Uh, wait. Go away, kid. Don't follow me. Just leave me alone. Dude, I just... I just want to thank you. Yeah, well, don't. Just... Just forget it. Forget you ever saw me. What? You, you forgot this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here, here. This... This is yours. Okay? Pick and break. Oh, they might have killed me. Thanks. Take it, okay? They might have killed you too. Yeah, well, thanks for the money. Uh, why'd you do it? Mister? You know you don't have to live here, right? You can live like this. But my mom, she could help you. Go home to her. I just want to talk to you. No. I just want to go away. Just go take care of her. Learn to fight, kid. In, in the bathroom, Mom. Okay.
No, he just gave me the usual rap, you know, the world according to Zeke and blah. Uh, tonight? I don't, I don't think so. Yeah, maybe tomorrow. All right, talk later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> All right, bye. Bye. I'm coming, Ma. Hey. Ooh. Hey. Shh. Patience. How was work? Great. Long, though. Great, long. Can you grab me the picture from the top shelf? I'll make us some tea. Reggie, what happened? Huh? What? What's wrong? Oh, uh, nothing. I, I pulled a muscle in gym class. A muscle? Yeah, it's a muscle, Mom. Leave the picture. Come here. Let's talk. want to hear all about it. Let me make sure I got this right. You were fighting with a homeless man? No. <laughs> no, no, no. He was fighting with pick and brick. Zig and Theo? Oh my god, better what? Mom, mom, it's okay. What part of this is okay, Reggie? Okay, you don't understand. All right, they were hassling me. And this homeless guy, and this homeless guy, he just, he just lost it, mom. Reg, what have I told you? To stay away. You promised me. Mom, they stopped me. Okay, and they were hassling me. And this homeless guy, Zeke, was hassling him. But the next thing I know, he was standing up to Brick and... The homeless guy. Oh, he was... It was unbelievable. I mean, he was like... He was like a, a boxer or something. I mean, yeah, yeah. Bam, bam. These big dummies on the ground. Really? A homeless guy did all this? Who is he? I don't know. You just some guy walking by. And what happened? Reggie? Zeke? He hit you. He's talking about Will. And? And I tried to hit him. What have I told you? It doesn't matter what he says. You don't do anything. You don't say anything. You just walk away. Mom, they do not let you walk away. Reggie? Please. I can't lose you too. I'm sorry, Mom. When he starts talking about Will, I mean, like he had nothing to do with it. Just get some mine. I know. Lo sé. We just can't let that anger poison our lives. I guess we should give thanks to the stranger too. <laughs> Mom, you should have seen him. Well, he could be dangerous, too. Oh, God. I want you to stay away from him. What do you mean? He helped me. This time, Reggie, but so many of those people are unstable. And if he's as talented as you say he is, it could be a scary thing. Hey, Mom, he wasn't crazy like the rest of them. You want to know what he said right before he beat on Brick? He said, you don't talk about a man's mother. Maybe so. But I want you to be careful. And I want you to stay as far away as possible from Zeke and Theo. Do you understand? They're going to want payback, Reggie. And they're not going to care who it is. Okay. Just don't go report him to anyone. Zeke? <laughs> That's going to make a difference. The homeless guy, Mom. Homeless guy? After what he did? He deserves a medal. <laughs> Keep that on. Good? Love you, Mom. Te quiero. Yo te quiero. <laughs>
You seen a guy this tall? Uh... Oh, I can. I can. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for a guy uh, this tall, rough around the face. He has a uh, he punches and you lost me like right me. sticking up for me and Will yesterday. Oh, my mom. I just want you to know that I understand and appreciate it. Okay? We just have to be careful if we're going to make it. Right? Right? Um, yeah, uh, right, right. Make okay. it. Let me see. Mm. <laughs> There's just a... I'm going grocery shopping, honey. Do you want anything? Uh, no, no thanks. Okay. Enjoy. See you in a bit. Bye. She made uh, some, some pancakes for me. She said I was a hero, you know, for sticking up for her and Will. But, but dude, you're the hero. You're the one who deserves them. What do you want, kid? 
Nothing. Where are you going? You thanked me, you gave me my medal. Get going. Your name's Lightning, right? <coughs> right? And the pancakes were good. Kid, I don't live in your world. My world's pretty ugly, and I can get ugly. Now get the hell out of here. Who are you? What are you doing here? You must have been somewhere. Yeah. A box, a boxer, right? I mean, because what you did, I mean, the way you, you laid into Brick, I mean, you were up and down that big bully like, like he was your punching bag. Yeah. Big ones are easy. They think they just have to show up. It's... It's what? Sneaky. Mean ones. Ones that'll do anything. You can see it in their eyes. Like, like pig? What do you want, kid? Leave me alone! Wait. Wait. Wait! Yesterday you said something. You said learn to fight. How am I gonna do that? Who's gonna t- I don't have anyone! Street punks, you know, they're all the same. Just got a few moves and lots of attitude. What are you doing? I'm just trying to thank you. Huh? Want to thank me? Thank this. Come over here. It's the footwork. Yeah, it's the footwork. Huh? That's right. Keep your feet under you. Now it's your turn. Big guy rushes you. Get. You don't back straight up. What you gotta do is give him an angle. Step to the side and pivot. See? Step to the side and roll under. Then, only then you strike. <laughs> See? Wait for it. Sooner or later, every big guy's gonna rush you. Why are you doing this, kid? I gotta... I gotta learn to protect myself. Protect my mom.
Know why you didn't hit that punk yesterday? What? Well, I'm ready to hit him. Yeah, you were mad. You wanted to hit him, but you weren't ready. You weren't in position to strike. See, that's what it's all about. You gotta be in position to strike first. Be where you need to be. What do you mean? So, were you gonna watch your movies with now, Mama? <laughs> be grateful. She's a smart girl, and she's in school, and she's in some little, yeah. like, uh, hoochie coochie on the street, right? <laughs> Amen to that. Yeah. Well, is that where he's on? Oh, yeah. As soon as we get home from church, I have to work on his project with Mariah. Aye. Now, don't you worry. He's always gonna be your boy. <laughs> Viv, have a boy of your own? Then tell me not to worry. <laughs> You know, it's not more or girls that worry about. I know. It's just growing up here, in this. You know, he had a run-in with Zeke the other day after school. Zeke? He's the one with the uh, the pick of you? Yeah, <gasps> the ice pick. Guess he followed Red home. Oh. He hit him. <gasps> what? What for? Well, you know what he's all about. Getting kids to deal for him. Just like he did well. You don't think Reg would? My Reg? Oh, Lord, no. It was sort of for him than do that. Mm -hmm. Not after watching his brother go down that road. Right, so why he hit him? Well, Reggie said he tried to hit Zeke first. He said that he was talking about me and Will. He can't go doing that. He can't always walk away either. He's got to learn to take care of himself. The Zeke's of the world, they ain't going away. No. And get this, Reggie said that they were also hassling some guy, some homeless guy, and that the guy, the homeless guy, <laughs> beat the hell out of the deal. You know, Zeke's big muscle. Yeah, yeah, that... What? <laughs> Do you believe that? <laughs> he said the guy beat him up and down, threw him on the ground, hit Zeke too, and oh. chased him off. <gasps> oh my god, this is crazy. I just mean, you're joking, right? Well, that was my weekend. How was yours? Mm. Neat. I didn't ask you about the cop thing. Mm. And? <laughs> it's not bad. But I think the boys in blue were on their best behavior for me. Mm. So you need to keep your panties on. <laughs> 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 but they're good guys and they know how to treat a lady. You know, I think we should double up next time. Mm. Uh, maybe. <gasps> sure. Mm, uh, maybe? Uh, maybe? <laughs> Big changes in the whole household. <laughs> Big changes. <gasps> I'm gonna hold you to that. Okay, psychic. So yeah. Girl. Anything you want. I don't. I see it in the future. <laughs> this is good. Oh, I'm gonna have to go to the gym. <laughs> you gotta move around. Relax. Punches and punches. <laughs> so uppercuts and hooks. Bam, 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 bam. That's it. Uppercuts and hooks for the body. Bam, bam. <laughs> Keep moving. Yeah. Move. Keep moving. Keep moving. Now we work. Now we work. Let me see you jab. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Get up. Get up. Move. Side to side. Relax. Come right. on. Stay loose. Stay loose. Shoulders loose. Kid, move. Okay. Kid, move. Move around. Side to side. Side to side. Come on. No, 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 no. Side to side. Left lead leads. Lead late. No, don't cross your legs. All right. Stand. Work a jab. Work a jab. Work a jab. That's your rear hand. That's your right. That's your cross. Your jab is yeah, your lead. This one feels good. No, no. Because it's the power hand. You get, you gotta. It's a right hand. It's a power hand. So you wait after your jab. You jab, and then you throw the right. You throw the right. Let me see you do your jab, kid. Jab. 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 Not that. 
That's the. I got it. Kid. This. What? This. This ain't working. I don't know if I'm the guy for this. No, 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 no. I, I, I can do it. Jam. Just, jam. Jam. No, no, don't cross your feet. You don't cross your feet, somebody will push you. You'll get knocked down to the ground. You don't do it. It's technique. It's important. Technique's important. You're lightning. It's, Patty talk. It's all right, lightning. Patty. I, I can, I can. Technique is important. Ah! This really sexy dress. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Who are you going with? Oh, well, now since you asked that, probably Eddie. Well, he's not that cute, so. Mm, okay. And besides, Stacy asked me out. Really? Yeah, and it was a great proposal. <laughs> well, I mean, no one else asked me, so. Oh, come on. That, that's not fair. <laughs> Ooh, all right, I gotta go. What? Gotta go. I thought we were supposed to go to the library. That was your plan. You were supposed to help me with it. Reggie! Yo, Lightning! Lightning, yo! Yo, Lightning! Yo, Lightning! What the hell are you doing? Lightning, yo. Where'd you get all this? What? You. What, you come around there growling like a bear and stuff? Yeah, well, come on, let's patch this stuff up. Come on. Yo, where'd you uh, get all this stuff? That old gym down on Philbert Street. My old gym. <laughs> I knew it. So you are from around here. Once upon a time. Oh, you gotta take me. Uh, please? No. It's been shut down for years, nothing but rats and garbage. Here, I got this for you. That's, uh... That's all we got, kid. Put it on. Yeah. Your head. Uh, yeah, uh, okay. Of course we should wash it first. Oh, come on. <laughs> Relax, hey, look what I got you. You don't have to put those on your head, put these on. Real deal boxing mitts. Come on, put them on. 
<laughs> Come on, man. That's it. You never know whose hands are in those. Thanks, man. Keep your hands up. Oh, you don't want this? Hands up. teach you about trapping. Trapping? Let's get the kid out of the way. Call it out. Jab! Jab! Oh, no. Jab! Yes! Jab! Yes! Yes! Come on, stand him up! Stuff. Knife! Your homeless hero's busy. Your boyfriend. You really shouldn't let a sweet little treat like you walk home by yourself. I just want to talk to you, sweetheart. Stop it! Hey, I just want to talk. You know why they call me pig, baby? Huh? I don't give a damn how sweet you smell. I will pick your ass apart. Nice piece. Don't touch it, Reggie. 
Reggie gifts. Yeah, I got a gift for Reggie. I'll see to it that Reggie gets his hands on this. You know what to do with it. He's hurt. Wait, are you hurt, honey? Mom, stop. I'm okay, all right? There Reggie. was a fighter that took a knife from me. Now, we need to get him in. Reggie, I am not a doctor. Mom, you studied to be a nurse, okay? You study this kind of thing all the time. I see you practicing your books. Now, help me get him in. Just, we'll take him to the hospital. No. Just wait right here. Just wait right here. No, I told you. No doctors, no hospital. Wait, wait, Reggie, light, light. wait. Stop, stop, stop. Mom, wait, wait, wait. Reggie, wait, wait, I wait. can't. Mom, mom, mom. This is the guy that helped me. I can't me. do it. Mom, please. This is the guy that helped me. Remember? Reggie, I. <laughs> Just put him in the kitchen. Come on. Go! Lightning, let me help you, okay? You help me now, let me repay the favor! Come on. Just... What's your name? Lightning. Not some street name. Your real name. It's not a street name, it was mine. Never mind. <laughs> well? Just call me Lightning. I will not. Everyone has a proper name. What's yours? Rodney. Rhodes. Rodney, I'm Jocelyn Hall. Reggie, can you please give me some towels from the laundry? And give me an old shirt of Will's and a t-shirt. Okay. How does that feel? Wonderful. You made quite an impression on Reggie. Yeah, well, he's a good kid. Thank you. It's not easy. What's that? A mother to raise a good son. No, sir. It's not. I wish you would see a doctor. So as well. Reggie's brother. So he's the reason for the bad blood with the punks, huh? That Zeke? Sucked him in. Got him into dealing. It wasn't long before Will started using. After that... You know the story. You've been around. I'm sorry. Reggie was devastated. Just about killed him. He still hasn't come to terms with it. But... What? Meeting you has helped. I don't want to insult you, but you stink. You're dirty. So take off your clothes and jump in the shower. Come on. Yeah. Got it. <laughs> yeah, I'm home. I'm coming, Mom. It's just me. I brought some towels. I'm sending them here. Thank you. Right, me. What are we gonna do? We? You just met me, you don't even know me. Yes, but you're involved now. Not just because of today, but you become part of Reggie's life. That's what happens when you make an impression on someone. No. No? 
You what? don't want that. You don't want me involved. Mr. Rhodes, we're all in this together, whether you like it or not. No. Sorry, there's no we. I mean, nothing good can come of that. Nothing ever does when I'm involved. Just, just let me go and walk away. You want to be better off that way. I'm sorry, did he hurt you? Are you, are you, are you okay? No, I, I mean, I'm okay. You, you sure? He didn't do anything. But what happened? He, he gave me this. What? You told me to make sure I gave them to you. You're supposed to sell them. This isn't what you've been doing, is it? No, 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 okay? I hate that stuff. All right, that's not me. Right, you know me. Okay? I'm scared. I'm so sorry. What are we gonna do? I don't know. Reggie, what's going on? All right? What happened? Sweetie! <laughs> Why Mariah? He could have just stopped me like he's done before. You would have just said no. This way you're stuck with it. I guess. I'm sorry, Reggie. He's telling you something. Yeah. He can get to the people you love. That's how cowards operate. I'm, I'm not gonna let anything happen to you, okay? This is between Zeke and me. Just what do you think you're gonna do? I don't know. All right, but I'm gonna tell him he doesn't do this. All right, he, he doesn't threaten her or you or anyone that I care about. All right, this is between us. No, you don't go near him. You'd be playing his game. But what, what Reggie? Yeah, your mom, yeah, she, she, she's right. I mean, do you think he's gonna listen to you? Hey, he's trying to draw you in, to engage you on his terms. What have I taught you? What have I taught you? Strike when you're ready. And not when the other guy wants you to. That's right. But what are we supposed to do? We go to the police. The cops? No. What, are we supposed to find one, give them this stuff, and tell them our story? Come on, Mom. Uh, Reggie, this isn't some schoolyard scuffle, honey. Uh, Reggie's right. It won't work, honey. It's not going to even get the drugs off the street. You hand them drugs to the wrong cop, I'll hand them right back to Zeke. Yeah, well, we go to the cops, and he'll kill us. You gotta fight. You gotta beat him in his own game. No, 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 there's not gonna be any fighting. R Reggie, I'm not saying we go running into a police station, okay? But it, we can't do this alone. It's just not gonna work, okay? Viv, she knows some cops, some detectives. What, Vivian? We can talk to them off the record, okay? We can talk to them, tell them what's going on. They could protect us, okay? Uh, they can warn him. I don't know. It's something, right? Let me just talk to them, okay? Let me just, please. Mariah, do you know by when Reggie had to do this? Did he say anything? No. Okay, this is what we're gonna do, okay? I really need to go home. It's getting late. Uh, I, I'll walk you home, okay?
They deserve better than this. We all do. Yeah. I better go too. You don't have to leave, you know? I can stay on the couch. Can't. What if they come back for you? You don't understand. I can't stay here. There'll always be a place for you here. If you ever need it. Yeah, well. Thanks. For everything. Be sure to come back so I can check on the cut. Just a scratch. Good night. Good night. WGCG Sports has an exclusive interview with legendary boxing trainer and coach Patty Greer. Greer is trainer to boxer Rodney Lightning Rod Rhodes, who went missing following the murder of his mother and is considered a person of interest in that case. Rhodes forfeited Thursday night's world title match when he failed to appear at preliminary weigh-ins earlier today. I asked Greer about this strange chain of events. Tragic. This is just tragic. This is Rhodes, a wonderful woman, dead like that and lightning missing. A talented young man like him, his career just shot. It's sad, Rodney is the most dedicated fighter I have ever known. For him to forfeit this fight, something's wrong. Mom? Reggie? Everything okay? Yeah. I mean, Mariah's shaking up is all, but she's fine. Well, she's scared. Is that what you've been doing with your time? Training with Rodney? You mean lightning? Yeah, he's been teaching me to box. You mean fight? Reggie, do you think it's a good idea to be spending all that time with a homeless boxer? Oh, come on, Mom. You talk to him. He's all right. Yes, I did, but... People like Rodney, you don't really know who they are. I know what you mean, Mom, but Lightning's not like that. I mean, you can tell, right? And he likes me. Yes. He does. He likes you. Well, I'm off to bed, Mom. Good night. Good night. Later in the day, Patty refuted any speculation that Lightning may actually be a suspect in his mother's death. No, absolutely not. Rodney was devoted to that woman. She raised him by herself in some pretty rough circumstances. She did a fine job. She raised a damn good man. There's no easy way for a woman to do that. Rodney and I, talked a lot about that.
really good today. I'm proud of you. Hey, uh, hey, how do you knock out a big guy? So you want to knock out a big guy. So what you got to do is you got to throw the overhand right. Now, it's not easy. It's not a straight right. It's a looping punch. You got to kind of throw it. Ah! Now I know how Patty felt. Patty? Not being able to do it. It was Patty. That's my trainer from a long time ago. He got too old, couldn't fight anymore. But you know, that son of a gun, he could look into the soul of a fighter, find the lion in him, and just unleash it. He's the one that made me the fighter I was. I <laughs> was? You mean the fighter you are? Yeah, right. <laughs> So, uh, when's your mom gonna see, uh, the cops? When's she gonna talk to them? Tonight. Off record. Off the record? How? Sort of a double date thing with her friend Vivian. Reg, don't expect anything. There's nothing in it for them. No, but my mom, she's well, got a lot of faith in her sister. Yeah. She told me about Will. How Zeke sucked him in. Got him dealing. And Will started using. And after that, that was it. It was all over. Reg. Reggie. That feeling? Hold on to it. talk to you about your problem. Can, uh, can we go inside? Sure. Nice house. Look, um, I know what your problem is. And I feel for you. I really do. I think it could help. You said without evidence, there was nothing you can do. <laughs> Martel said that. Me, I get it. I know about your son and all. I know your whole story. You just want a little payback. I never said that. No, no, of course not. But look, if uh, you want to play some ball, maybe we could help. I don't play ball. A little quid pro quo. Isn't that what the lawyers say? You do for me, I'll do no, for you. No, no! Get your hands up! Get your, get, get your hands up! Get, get off! Get off me! Get off! Okay, I'm no whore. No, you're not a whore. Whores are smarter than you. Here comes your choir boy now. Mom, what's going on? Your mother's trying to save your punk ass. But she's too stupid to. Oh, Shut up Reggie, and get out of here. No, no. Oh, yeah? What, what happened? Settle down, Chuck. What the hell happened? You dropped your left, fat man. Kid hit me? You're screwed, kid. Come on, just like your brother and every other piece of garbage in this town. You don't! You're finished! If the gangbangers don't get you, I will! Are you okay? Huh? No, not these people. Wait right here. I'll be right back. This scumbag hurt you? 
are you okay? Jones, I am so sorry. I had no idea he was such a... You didn't know. I know, but still, I... How about this guy, huh? He has got some skills. Mr. Rose was right. You don't have talent. You can take care of yourself. I can take care of you. You okay? She never touched me. <laughs> yeah. well, I can see that. <laughs> Is he gonna have any trouble because of this? Nah, I don't even think Chuck will remember, but if he does, I'll take care of him. Thank you. Well, I think it's the least that I can do, right? <laughs> Where did you learn to fight like that? A friend sort of teaches me what he knows. It's nothing big. Well, he's either a great teacher or, man, you're a natural, because I think you start competing. Get a real coach. Really? Well, yeah, you're already better than half of those guys at the police athletic league. <sighs> well, we have other things to think about first. Mm. That's right. Yeah, that's a tough one. Without any evidence. You said you destroyed the drugs, right? I did. Well, without that, what do we have? Just someone with a grudge trying to pitch a pretty unlikely story. No offense. We know. All right, well, let me sleep on it, and I'll see what I can come up with. Thank you. OK. Ready? John Miko. Right. Hi. 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 Thank you. Anyway, he seems pretty cool. And he said he's gonna see what he can do. You're just saying that because he liked your boxing. No. Okay, I mean, yeah, but no, he was cool. I mean, not like the other guy. The other guy was like a bad cop out of a bad movie. Martel was cool. Besides, and Vivian likes him too, so. Right, uh, I'll talk to my mom later. Call you then? Reg, wait. I want to be with you. Please. I really want to see what you do with him. Yeah, but it's kind of one of those... Reg, if it's important to you, then it's important to me. Yeah, but... Mm -hmm, please. Come on, <sighs> Reg. Okay, 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 okay. But one condition. Okay, if lightning isn't cool with it, you'll leave. Okay. Okay? Okay. All right, come on. She just wanted to see what it is we do, if it's okay with you. She's curious, you know? It's okay with you. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just don't let it be a distraction. <laughs> what? Slip to the left, slip to the right. Ha, ha, ba, 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 ba.
should be good. about to rain, come on. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Yo, yo, yo. Where are you guys going so fast, huh? Theo, look, man. I don't have any fight with you, all right? I'm just trying to get home. Get home? It ain't happening. They give you something. Something for you to sell. You did that? You got my money? Man, I don't What's have, my money? I don't have it, all right? You don't have my money? You don't know. <sighs> Reggie, you got two days. Two days! If a pig goes mad, go crazy, or your mama! Ah, your little sweet thing over here. Because <laughs> you know he likes it. I like it too. And you can't forget about your homeless hero. Because he's done. He's finished! Without some help at least. It's gotta be off somewhere. This place looks abandoned. Stop. All right? I'm Reg, I'm scared. Come on. I'll get you home. There's another place I know. Lightning. Lightning. Don't worry. I'm sorry. Mariah called. Did you at least find him? Well, there's more you should know about lightning. Come inside, I'm gonna show you. Come on. No, no, no! Reg. I, no, I, I don't believe it. Reggie. Mom, you, you don't think lightning did this, do you? No, I don't. I think he's a good man. But... But? But what? It does explain things, Reggie. Explain? Explain what, Mom? If you don't think Lightning did this, explain what you mean. The way he lives. What? Reggie, if he thinks he caused this, he lives with tremendous guilt. And if he knows who did it, he may be in trouble. He may have no choice but to run. But it doesn't sound like Lightning. It doesn't make any sense. Reggie, I understand. But something like this can change a person. Forever. It may be why he's gone now. What do you mean? We're thinking about talking to the police, right? Not about lightning. No, not about lightning, but when we're thinking about bringing them in. Okay, even if we don't say anything, someone eventually one day was gonna say something. 
And if the police hear something about a homeless boxer, right? So what do we do? We take care of all this garbage with Zeke. Mom, what about if- Reggie. We can't just forget about him. We won't. But you know, he would want you to be safe. Let me see what I can do. I'll go look for him also, okay? You know, he was quite a fighter. Top contender for the middleweight title. Next to long? Yep. Next in line. Contender, the best fighter I ever worked with. Daddy? Now, flat on your back like a bum. Now get up! Fight ain't over. Oh, Patty, it's over. How many times did I tell you it don't ever end? You pick yourself up off the map day after day, it doesn't matter. If the bell rings, it doesn't matter. If they count you out, you gotta get up. Honey, they killed Mom. I know, right? I know. You didn't see her. You don't know. Those, Those cowards. They beat her and they left her to die. She old me. But you're still alive, kid. You still got things to do. I can't. I'm done. Look at me. The boy and that woman. They need you. And you need them. <laughs> I'll just bring them trouble. Get up, Rodney. No. Get up! No! Get up, Rodney! No! Rodney? Come on, Rod. I know you're here. I know you can hear me. I just wanted to thank you for bringing my son back. I told you how it was when Will died. Reggie was devastated. Lost. Meeting you did something for him. I don't know why that is. I don't understand why you of all people, boxing of all things, would do that. But thank you. Seeing so alive and happy might have saved us both. Even though I have no idea what's going to happen. I've got some hope. Reggie. 
But you told me about this place. So this is where you trained. I guess this was your world once upon a time. I wish I would have seen you then. I wish we both knew you then. Rod, I know why you disappeared. I get it. I know the story, but I don't believe it. Reggie doesn't either. You've had your problems, but you're a good man. Such a good man. But Rod, you can only run for so long. Someday, I'm gonna have to come back and face this. If not, we lost as well. Promise me you'll come back for Reggie. For us. For me. Promise yourself you'll come back. Be safe, Rodney Woods. just this is not part of an official investigation it's just there's just not a whole lot I can do I'm just telling my captain I have a tip and that someone wants to talk are you sure Zeke will be looking for you tomorrow if not I can find him I mean he practically lives on the street yeah but you can't talk to him on the street it's got to be somewhere somewhere where I can overhear what's being said like an alley uh, I know one that might work I, I could bring him to it Nah, that's not gonna work. It's too open, and, and, and someone could just come on by. An empty building? That may work. As long as we can get in and out of the place, sure, why not? I have the place. Reggie, so where is this old gym? Over on Philbrick Street. No, but you're not going. But I should go. No, you shouldn't be getting involved with stuff like this. I belong with you. With me, yes. Will is my brother. Okay, and Zeke is my problem, and... Why? And I love you. Okay? I love you. Man, I got you in trouble once. I don't want to do it again. I love you, too. Please be careful. Nothing's gonna happen. My will be there. Hey, my will be there. Okay? All right, get out of here. Well, Zeke comes looking for you and you can't run away. Go. Go. Here. If anything happens, you call 911 immediately on my phone, okay? I'm gonna leave it here for you. Okay. And do not, no matter what, come in. I'm gonna go in and, and wait for them. Why don't you get in the front? Help, uh, help Viv keep an eye out, okay?
somebody in. We need some privacy for this one. Reggie. Reggie! Are they coming? They're here. All right, go to your spot. I'll be right here. where you hang with your broke down homie? Where is he? Not here? Too bad. <laughs> What's all this? You think I'm gonna climb in here and settle this with you mano a mano? Well, we gonna settle it. Not that way. We ain't fighting. Money? I told you. I ain't selling your crap. No? That's your final answer? Okay. So where is it? Where's the goods? Gone. Wrong answer! Doesn't matter, they're still gone. My money? Or my drugs? I'ma put you in cold, cold ground. Just like I did you. Hold it right there. You set me up. You're dead, boy. Dead! Put the gun down. You ain't got nothing on me. We need to have a confrontation. Everybody's going to jail. I just want to talk, you know. Put the gun down. I just want to talk. What you want to talk about, huh? You put yours down first. Okay. Let's do this together. Watch out, no! Shit, I ain't gonna shoot no cop. Not with a witness. Martell! See? I'm putting it down.
kill my brother. Bravo! Bravo! I just inherited a business. And I get to kill you both. Tell. a man, a good man, we know you are. It's not that simple. It, it, it's not what you think it is. You can clear your name. You gotta understand, it's not that. It's not the cops. It's the people that did it, the people that killed Ma. They'll never let the truth come out. They can't. Too many powerful people will never let the truth be known. Remember that. It has to be a way. strong. Kid, you take care of Jocelyn. Let me get this straight. You were on the ground, then what? They were fighting. He knocked the punk's gun down. And then Zeke, he tried to stab him. Who? Martel. Who was fighting? Who? The boy, Reggie. And that punk ass Zeke. You sure? You know, the kid can fight. Get him out of here. What have I taught you? You don't want this. That's it. Your hands up. See that jab? See that jab? Right, right. Get on this. That old gym down on Fulbright Street. My old gym. What's wrong, Roger? Well, you know as well as I do, it should be his name up there. Not mine. I know. Whatever it takes, I'm going to clear his name. Champion of the world, Reggie the Rocket Paul! 